Well, one thing people love about Halloween, ghost stories, and there are plenty to go around locally. News 5's Alan Sheehan continues our coverage, sharing a few ghost encounters that people have had at Manitou Springs. You know, it's Halloween town time year round. Originally built in 1895, the Miramont Castle in Manitou Springs has had several reports of spiritual encounters. When you work here, it you're going to experience something. It just depends on when. Throughout its rich history, the castle has served as a hospital and apartment building. Since 1976, it's been an artifact museum and tea house. It's just a magical building. Kelly Rule Ingman and Jennifer Gerardo work on the top floor of the castle. Spirits. We love the word <laughs> spirits or um, as I always say when people ask if the castle is haunted, I don't care for the word haunted. It is inhabited and we have residents. They often encounter spirits. I'm walking doo doo doo. The window's there, there's no air conditioner, no air, nothing. My hair is long and it was down and this whole side of my hair was picked up and dropped and I'm like, yo. Kelly grew up behind the castle. She would walk down these stairs and through this garden on her way to school. I always saw a little boy and a little girl playing in the gardens. And it made me mad because I'm getting on a bus and going to school. Why aren't they? Well, they weren't real. She says a lot of the castle's visitors will ask her about the boy and girl in the yard. They actually describe him exactly how I saw them when I was seven, eight, and nine. Jennifer says sometimes she can hear a little girl's voice. We were leaving one night, so we were walking down that hallway there, and we always say good night, everybody. And I heard the little girl say bye, just as clear as day. Miramont Castle is not the only place in Manitou Springs with a few ghost stories. There is some hauntings that go on, especially here. Down the road at the Armadillo Ranch restaurant. The bottles from the top of the bar um, where the beer cans are have fallen down. Glasses have come off the glass rack and flown. Lights turn on. Noises are heard on a regular basis. The owners say these weird occurrences are part of what makes Manitou unique and maybe just a little bit spooky. There's that element of kind of spiritualness that will happen and I think does draw people to Manitou. In Manitou Springs, Eleanor Sheehan, News 5.